Is, are there stories behind all this software came about? Because really, when you think about it, there's no reason for any of this to exist. Like, it's just too small a community. This exists because, you know, people, they did the numbers and they did it anyway, really. I got a little bit frustrated because I couldn't really find diagrams that were accurately fitted to the rough that I had. This is really working the way I want it to. And did I like buy something that I shouldn't have? And why am I going to all this effort to try and create a custom design for it? I cut a, cut a couple of ovals and got really interested in design. And, and I had a background in computer software. I went, mm, this is, this is interesting. <laughs> this was appealing to me because I could work out the math with the angles around the stone and figure out what the angles were. So if I can do that, well, surely I can model the entire stone and work out angles and indexes for the whole thing. There's, there's got to be a better way. My math background came into play and I should be able to do it mathematically. Like that's that's what it comes down to. There's no way that I'll ever get my time back, the, you know, the money that I could have been doing databases. Now I get a new tool, people get a new tool, I get to meet people, I get to be, you know, be thrown into a community and maybe inspire the next generation of toolmakers to, to push what I've done.